Boston trailing. On the floor for Boston. They've got Dennis Schroeder. Tristan Thompson is out there with Marvin Bagley. Then there's Robert Williams. And it's insanity in a point guard. Pass to Thompson. Outside Bagley. Just five on the clock. His first shot coming late. Thompson's shot is off. Gotta love how they've been crashing the board. Fighting hard for every miss. Hill the pass to Middleton. And he sinks the 11-footer. And the Bucks lead by six. It's like he needed that halftime break to gather himself. Now he's starting to get his confidence back here. His insanity buries it from three. Give him 39. And that was the right decision. When you're in need of a bucket, you go to your most trusted guys. Yeah, whether it's teammates or the coaching staff, hopefully a combination of both, but gets close. He's getting the ball. Now here's Holiday. Shoots from 12. Rebound Boston. Bagley's got six rebounds here tonight. Not great numbers, but great effort in this one. Sounds funny, but I think he's been a positive for them. And stolen by Ana de Cupo. About a minute and a half through the fourth quarter now. And they double up Ana de Cupo. Shots good by Hill. All right, guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Bucks. Their activity at the defensive end has been impressive. Attacking and coming away with steals. Well, you add to that, their block totals tonight. They've been very feisty and active on the defensive end. And so it's Boston with it. The Bucks getting their last shot to go. Six on the shot clock. Here's Schroeder. Yes, it's good. This is why Schroeder has the ball in that situation. If the pick comes, he knows how to capitalize. Williams against Honor Kumpo. Here's Middleton. And it's Middleton finishing it off. And you can't leave the basket unprotected. Bad things will happen to you. Yeah, that was just way too easy. Will not find a higher percentage opportunity than that. Good! Another from three. The three is coming fast and furious. He is scorching the nets. Yes, and now tied to the third most three-point field goals in a single game in playoff history. Time called here. The Bucks decide to talk it over. Making a switch here. Lopez is checked in. Richardson's checked in for Boston. Gives us a chance to catch up with Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Mike Budenholzer was going over with his team. He told them this is a game that we can win. It's a game we should win. We've matched those guys step for step. From this point forward, let's try to force them to play at our tempo. And Allie, thank you for that. Milwaukee in the lead. Middleton outside. Pass to Ana de Kumpo. Let's the three fly. That's Middleton. That time on the assist from Ana de Kumpo. Ana de Kumpo has got his sixth assist of the night. Outside Richardson. Here's Insanity. Back to Richardson. There's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's his third personal. Remember Josh Richardson, the second round pick. He has come a long way in this league in a short time. A great athlete who shoots it well and enjoys playing the D. Shooting two. for him. Staring at this deficit, they're trying to be more aggressive and get themselves to the line. That 
that one falls. So he hits both of them. At this point, you might as well go ahead and chalk up the points when he's at the free throw line. Pretty much automatic. Outside Holiday. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Anadokounmpo is double. Banked it in off the glass. Anadokounmpo has got 44. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Outside Schroeder. Williams with it. Here's Insanity. Takes it inside. Got a piece of it. Now get that out of there. That's all timing right there. Drew Holiday continuing hustle play. And Holiday powers it home. Oh, excellent way to pad the lead. Yeah, especially when it's your one throwing it down like that. Oh, yeah. His teammates love that one. I'm sure he's going to hear about it when he gets to the huddle. Now here's Thompson. Richardson finds Thompson. And the layup is good off the glass. Thompson's gotten his first basket of the night. Not easy to prevent Tristan Thompson from scoring in that position. Got to try to body him up. Here's DiVincenzo. And a strong finish with two hands. Just great offense. The screen freeing him up for the slam. Hey, without that screen, he doesn't get a clean look at the rim. Yeah, we'll have to settle for the layup when you can attack the rim and rise up like that. Now here's Thompson. Here's Insanity. No good there. Some solid defense from Holiday. And they just continue to dominate the boards. To the paint. Here's Lopez. And it's Lopez with the jam. Lopez at that size has no trouble throwing it down. Outside Richardson. Tipped away. Now here's Holiday. Outside, DiVincenzo. Inside. Outside, Holiday. Six to shoot. Middleton from the outside. Williams grabs the board. Williams has got a rebound number five here tonight. Here's Insanity. And again for three. He's putting on a shooting exhibition that has left this entire arena in awe. And you know he finds himself tied for second place all time in three-point makes for a playoff game. Outside Holiday, pass to Middleton. Over Richardson. Middleton, no good. Well, he's a guy they count on to produce from the mid-range. He doesn't miss too many open looks from there. Yeah, and he gets that one. A heady play there from Schroeder, zipping the pass to the teammate who had the cleanest look on the possession. Here's Anadokounmpo. The Celtics making their last shot. Pass to Holiday. Middleton against Richardson. Corner shot. The offensive rebound. Outside, DiVincenzo. Back to Anadokounmpo. Anadokounmpo is doubled. Another shot. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Boston's gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Insanity, no good. The Bucks have gotten eight of 13 shots to find the basket in the fourth quarter. Pass to Middleton. Anadokounmpo, right side. DiVincenzo on the wing. Goes up on the baseline. That one doesn't drop. Now the Celtics take it the other way. Schroeder with it. Ooh, the lead pass was in the perfect spot to set up the layup. Now just a two-point Bucks lead. And Schroeder did not even have to think twice about that shot. This young man simply devours these chances inside. And the Bucks call time here. And the other team is running all over them right now. The timeout before the timeout here, maybe just to cut off the momentum and have a chit-chat with the team to settle down.
And now let's take a look at the New Balance player of the game, Giannis Antetokounmpo. He has truly put on a show out there tonight, tearing it up on both ends of the floor. So impressive. And the other squad has looked helpless to stop him. Milwaukee's gone one for two from deep in this fourth quarter. Pass to Holiday. Antetokounmpo, left side. Here's the break. And he hits it to tie the game. And that was just moving the ball quickly. And he's rewarded at the end with the high percentage look. Yeah, the defense trying to do their best to slow him down. But when he gets room like that, you got to look out. Now here's Holiday. Pass to Middleton. Back to Lopez. Horford with a steal. to take the lead second chance effort and the layup is good and a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for the Celtics their activity at the defensive end has been impressive attacking and coming away with steals they have not wasted any time here tonight they have pushed it whenever they've had the opportunity and have gotten a lot of fast break points out of it now here's Schroeder that one no good to shake and bake. To halt the run. Count that one. He's now five for eight. Well, that equals his three-point total in the first half. He had one before the break, and that's his first three of this half. Here's Schroeder. Here's Insanity. Takes a three. Connects again from distance incandescent from long range the defense throwing up their hands how do you stop them and he's now tied the single game playoff record for three pointers made pass to Anadokounmpo here's shake and bake covered by Schroeder clock at six Schroeder comes with a double team now Holiday. oh stolen by Richardson and here we go the Celtics on the run yet another bucket my goodness, 50 for the game. Just putting on a show. The Bucks trail. A minute 53 left in the fourth. Holiday passes to Anadokounmpo. Back to Holiday. Here's shake and bake from deep. Rebound Boston. Horford's got four rebounds in the game. Driving in. Insanity. The Beast. It's good on the putback. Now it's a six-point Celtic lead. Just great positioning to get the rebound and get it back up. To the inside. And they double up Arda Kumpo. Holiday from long range. Good. And Arda Kumpo gets the assist. Arda Kumpo has got assist number seven tonight. There's a minute 12 left to play in the fourth quarter. Insanity, no good. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that open. Back to Anadokounmpo. And he buries it. Oh, what a sensational bucket. That brings him within one. Here's Insanity. He's covered by Holiday. Schroeder passes to Horford. Down low is insanity and got it. Another basket. <laughs> That's 52 points for him, making it all look too easy right now. Timeout called. Milwaukee. They're behind by three. 44 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter.
Poe. The pass to Lopez. Outside Holiday. Tries yet again. Misses at the rim. Well, he had the perfect opportunity to finish that one, guys. He just flat out blew it. And again for three. Well, what can you say? But, but wow. I mean, he's done it. The most three-point makes in NBA playoff history. A momentous achievement. One that'll surely be celebrated around the globe. And honestly, I can't remember the last time I saw a player this hot from long range. In the playoffs, no less. He's having an historic night. And this shooting display could be in a museum. An absolute masterpiece from deep. Milwaukee with it. They trail by six. The three ball. They get it back. And that's out of bounds. Milwaukee will keep it. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. Yeah, this is the elevated energy level you expect in the postseason. Chasing down blocks and making an impact. There's 14 seconds left in the game. Here's Shake and Bake. Grabs the rebound again. Collecting yet another board. He has been everywhere. Just an animal. Well, he could just see over the defense. The, the eyes to spot the open man. Giannis flourishing right now as a facilitator. And Boston calls time here. They're in front by three. Seven seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. seconds left in the final quarter and they commit an intentional foul we'll see another one of those so they get into the penalty yeah just trying to keep this game alive not a bad foul right there five ticks left to play in the fourth and that's an intentional foul And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to go. And he can't get the second one to drop either. Coming up empty that time. And so they choose to intentionally foul. You don't want to stop the clock right there. I'm not quite sure what he was thinking. Looking to even the score with a huge three. Well, you can bet that's what they're looking for. This late in the game, they need that three. And so it's Boston who scrapes by with the win.
A huge victory for them, nodding this series to two. We've got ourselves a series, folks. Neither team with much of an advantage. It's a tight one. And so this one is in the books. We hope you've enjoyed being with us for the Eastern Conference Finals. For Ali LaForce, Brent Barry, Grant Hill, and our entire 2K Sports crew, this is Brian Anderson signing off. We'll see you next time.